Welcome to the video. In this series, we're working on top of an application we've previously created. I wanted to make this a different series because I'm giving another direction to the application, so it kind of makes sense not to combine them. Now, let me show you what I'm talking about and what we're working, we're gonna work on in the next couple of videos. So here I have the universal search bar that's been built in uh, a previous series and I'll link to it in the description if you want to catch up. And in short, this minimalistic app stays on top of your windows and you input text, hit enter or click the search button and you can conveniently switch between search engines, Google, and DuckDuckGo.com um, in this case and here is the app that we're gonna build I already built it but I'm gonna do it again for the sake of showing you how I did it as you can see there are some visible differences but there are some more differences more major differences under the hood now let me explain first I added more options. You can search for books on Amazon and for videos on YouTube. Then I added an icon over here and also a voice search button that's probably the most important feature that we're working on. It's going to be cool and uh, I'm sure you're going to like it too. Now let me demonstrate how this search functionality works. Let's select Google and click the search bioinformatics research. Okay. All right, now let me close these. So under the hood, um, you can see that the first application that we've previously created has only 45 lines of code. So it's kind of simplistic and anyway, it serves its purpose. While this one that we're going to work on has like 120 lines of code. So there's a lot of work to, to do in the next few videos. Um, so anyway, this is what we're going to work on. Uh, to be more specific, in the next video, um, we'll discuss the additional modules that you have to install to be able to follow along with coding. So uh, that's just about it for this one. If you enjoyed the video, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe and stay tuned. Thank you for watching.